welcome back to this channel and thank you so much for choosing to watch this video today I am going to take you for a tour yep you know guys I love taking you for tours that they bought and uh, so far I love the neighborhood and I said you know what let me bring you with me yeah this place looks so quiet and nice clean and everything so let's go check it out let's go check this house out wow guys you can see how nice this place looks i love these homes they are so cool yeah i can't wait to see her house oh my gosh so guys i have arrived and this is the home oh my gosh it is so huge this is a five bedroom house and let me take you right in because you know what <laughs> and we're gonna go through the garage that's the garage as you can see it's it doesn't have anything as i told you guys you can see um they clean up after they finish building the house they clean up and it's even the walls are super clean because uh let me try to zoom it in even the walls are still super clean you can see they always leave some um some spare paint so that if you want to if you want to paint your house again you can know the kind of paint you are able to match it or something i don't know why i think that's the reason why they always leave the spare uh, paint so you know what guys i'm gonna go right in so this is uh the door from that's the garage door as you can see i entered through the garage i don't know where to start i think the best place to start is from the garage let me start with this um bedroom here this is a one level home and oh my god look at this door ha 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 wow so this is a, a small room this can be like a study room or um because it's just a small i think this is a study room or an office because i don't think this is a you can make it a bedroom you know it, it can be a bedroom they can i believe that's what i don't know exactly what they're gonna do with it and you can see it's uh that's the carpet so that's a brand new carpet uh everything is brand new in this home uh yeah duh so i don't know i think they're gonna make this uh an office but it has a closet here and so that's the garage door that's why i just uh i came in through that door and this is uh let's see what's in here oh the bathroom wow i love that little blue light did that light and it's just um making this place look so blue so that's the uh that's a this side bathroom i guess the guests can use this as you can see the sink just nice and new and i love everything here you can see the cabinet nothing in here because it's a brand new home they haven't moved uh they're not they're gonna move in end of the month yeah it's their home now they can move in i guess whenever whenever they are ready but you can see that little light that's so cool yeah let me close the door because i don't want to be kicked out of here uh leaving things the way 
uh i did not find them so you know what guys let me turn this way because that's the living room y'all y'all that's the living room guys you can see how big the the living room or sitting room is you can hear my echo oh goodness look it's just our window at that side there's nothing uh on this side there's nothing else like the wall or is just window window glass huh just glass fancy huh <laughs> remember don't try to build like this in kenya and then leave uh, in africa and then leave uh your wall like the way the wall is out there let me show you you can see they haven't done the backyard yet one thing at a time i'm just saying imagine in africa you build your home and you leave all glass uh the outside is all glass and then you dare you dare to leave the wall like this let me tell you the next day you can wake up to a very clean house that's the ac down there that's the ac this is the backyard yeah in africa if you leave your if you leave the wall this uh this short and then the glass <laughs> just the glass they can clean the house uh the thieves who clean the house for you uh -huh. look at the neighbor's home i love that blue paint as well so guys whoa they are going to put um something back here so when you buy a house a new home you just buy it with the backyard not done at all so it's your job to fix your own backyard but when you go to the model homes they come with a really beautiful backyard so you might think oh this is how my house will come uh looking like no uh sorry sorry to say when you buy a house it doesn't come with the backyard all done but if you want to buy upgraded house with the backyard done or the pool you just pay extra all you need is to pay extra so those are the neighbors houses over there so going back in you can see guys i'm going back in and the houses here in the u.s you always know notice or realize they have a screen the outdoor screen you know the the mesh or what you call it this screen so it's good whenever you open your door you can just leave the screen like this anyway guys back inside here oh my god the echo because the house is just empty look at that isn't that amazing this is so cool i love this and i love these uh small windows on this side it's this house is just perfect and guys i just this is my dream home uh whenever god will open the doors for me i pray to have a spacious house like this and yes of course everything is possible with god so this is um uh this is their island i love this oh my god i love this space i'm so much in love with this space so you can see they haven't installed the fridge yet they have left that space for the fridge uh and then those are the cabinets and this microwave is not the this is just a rental is just temporary for now but they're gonna install a microwave there and you can see the oven is it yeah the oven right there and uh yeah you can see the the cook uh, um what do you call it is the grill the cooker is it how come it's oh i thought it's on mm -hmm. i have to make sure every time i see this kind of light i'm like i have to be very sure that it's not on oh it says locked so yeah that is the burner or the cooker or whatever you want to call it yeah look at those um drawers guys huh? look at all those perfect drawers so many drawers when whatever you want to put uh i mean they're gonna decide to put their high i don't know if they're gonna be getting stools or what you know in my house i only use the two i never use the other two up there i only use that and that in my house because i know they they can be sometimes they can be very high and you're like you don't even know how to reach the top top like especially this one <laughs> on top of the fridge of course nobody will ever use that one but this house is perfect so my friend will be moving here end of the month and um 
they are I, i'm sure they're very excited about it of course they are moving from another state uh, that for sure because yes those people from other out of state they are the ones who are finishing the homes here for us in arizona <laughs> but they are welcome we love people uh from other states to come and so that to jazzy state you know we can be many many and the homeowner here the house owner is a kenyan so guys uh those are extra stuff from the i guess for the home still i hope i have shown you every single thing that um how the house looks like before it's finished i don't know if it's my my phone let me guys i'm so sorry for the lighting because i'm i hope i hope you can see it good the lighting is not the best and i'm using my phone i don't know if... oh sorry i tried to clean my um my camera and it didn't make any any difference so let's go to the master bedroom this is the master bedroom and you can see the window there the master bedroom and it has a perfect view of the neighbor's home and also we go back to that light again and this is how the master bedroom bathroom looks like if i go back a little bit uh then i can show you going in you can see the closet oh i think we left the light on yeah i can just switch off the lights no need to waste the lights um Kuharibu steamer. I just turned off the light, but I can turn. That's this is the closet for the master bedroom. You can see how it looks like. That's the closet, and also this is. You know what I'm in love with? I'm in love with this walking shower. This walking shower is just perfect. You just walk in there and you just take your shower. Wow! Look, if I live here, I will be taking a shower every day. So. You notice there's no door right there because they never they don't put doors they just leave it and whenever you're taking a shower if it's a husband taking a shower the wife will be waiting in bed and vice versa so and that's your girl Betty AZ uh and now you can see those uh two sinks right there i mean the sink right all brand new god this is so perfect i love white and that's the toilet in that uh, master bedroom bathroom everything good let's go back i'm sorry once again if i'm shaking this camera so this is the pantry guys let me show you the pantry so that's the pantry i love these doors so that's the pantry look at how big this pantry is so this this is how beautiful the pantry is so this is what you get when you buy a new house in arizona it's uh you get a very spacious house you get a very beautiful house and yeah there's another cabinet right here as far as as soon as you walk in there's another cabinet there you can hang your coats when it's cold your jacket so that's a that's a bathroom uh, that's a laundry room in here they have a laundry room in there and they have those cabinets whenever they're doing their laundry my god they're so oh i'm so happy for them so that's a one bedroom that's another closet this house has a lot of closets and cabinets and stuff like that that's another bedroom and that's another bedroom hey and so many bathrooms and that's another bedroom right there and of course it has um it has a closet yeah but what you realize they don't oh that's the ac it says it's 70 degrees what you realize they don't build uh the bedrooms like they're not the bedrooms are not very spacious very very but they're enough for like a queen size and you'll get some extra space and also enough for the kiddos and stuff like that so that's the, the tub so two of the bathrooms have a tub and that's how it looks like guys i tell you yeah, it's a very beautiful home so that's the door going out if you want to go out and see your neighbors or when you're leaving for work that's what you get you walk out that way <laughs> okay 
I'm almost done, my dear friends. Look at that model right there. Beautiful, right? That style, that design. So yeah, that's that's the new. So guys, that's how the this beautiful space looks like. Thank you so much for watching this video. Oh my God! Please let me know on the comment section below what you think about this beautiful space. This tour of the empty home. Yeah, I tell you. Yeah, Kenyans here they are not playing. So if anybody tell you that Kenyans abroad they are playing just tell them betty tells us that kenyans abroad they are not playing kenyan in you kenyans in the u.s they are not kidding you know they want to live a good life so i will tell you the price of this home it's in the 500s okay i won't um I don't know exact price but I know it's in the 500s and when I talk about the 500s I'm talking about half a million dollars I am not talking about Uganda's Uganda's money huh? <laughs> I'm not talking about cities I am not talking about uh, whatever uh, Kenya shillings I am talking about in the five um, in the half a million Kenya I mean dollars oh my god forgive me if I keep talking about Kenya that's my country of course but I know there are so many people from different countries here so Africans here they are not playing in fact we have a we, there's an, another lady from Ivory Coast who lives close here there's another lady from um, Cameroon who lives close here it's still the same kind of space you know okay uh, once again, Kenyans, uh, Africans, when they come here, they don't waste their time. They, they go for opportunities and they love to live, they, they love to live a good life. You know, they don't deny themselves. Um, they don't deny themselves nothing. Thank you for watching. Come with me, um, come with me to another tour of Betty's new house so what you need to do is if you want to come with me to my tour tour of my own house you better start the journey with me on your knees start the journey on your knees and pray for my house so that i'll next time i'll take you to my own beautiful home tour okay so you're gonna come with me to betty's easy new home tour but start let's start on our knees Thank you for watching. God bless you. I love you all. Thank you. Bye. So guys, this is how this neighborhood looks like. You can see uh, they're still fixing the roads and still some of the houses are not even done yet. Uh, so they are not some of the houses are not even completed and others are and people are moving in. Others are, are not have not yet moved in. So yeah, it's a whole this whole place there is full of construction you can see some of the houses like the one on the on the left is being constructed still and uh, oh wow let me show you the nice. models look at those decorations can you imagine yeah if you see this in a store you will just ignore it and think it's now uh, it's not beautiful but what hi guys see look at that rug it matches everything so that's the dining table uh, what do you think everybody do you like what you see that's the dining table oh my god even the plates everything oh and that is the living area yeah you can see this beautiful couch everything matches so perfectly every single color blends in really cool you can see that beautiful um cabinet right there and the tv wow i'm telling you i need to have my home uh designed like this so i need an interior designer <laughs> when i have my house remember i told you if you want me to sh to do a house tour of my own house you'd go on your knees and claim it house for betty az